Kazimir Shinkevich, and this is my flamethrower. Uh, it's basically a gas grill gone wrong, so grilling hot dogs is a little boring. And I took uh, my propane tank from the gas grill and added a, a small solenoid valve and a little bit of uh, plumbing here with an orifice, so I've got a nice pilot fire. And uh, a little more power than I need, but I got a car battery on there and, and a basic safety switch and a, and a momentary push button. So I push this button. I energize the solenoid, which allows the full tank gas pressure of the propane tank uh, to come out this, this second pipe here. Voila. Fire. Why did you do this? This fire is cool. Here's something else you know. Did you design this on paper first, and uh, then uh, no, see it through? Or you just sort of put some stuff together. This is purely dumpster diving. <laughs> now, describe when the thought originally came to you that you could make a a giant <laughs> flamethrower out of a car battery and your grill. Actually, uh, Bill Gerstel came to me and said, "I need a flamethrower for my robot. Uh, can you put something together for me?" And um, so we started putting some parts together in my garage, and, and we hadn't thought about it too much. And his, his robot isn't too controllable, and neither was my fire. We almost burned my garage down. Uh, but uh, luckily, we've got some safety features on it now, like a shutoff valve, uh, so we don't burn the garage down. Um, where are we going with that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, tell me about some of the safety features that are on there. Uh, we got a shutoff valve so that if uh, our, our valve out here fails, you can you can manually turn off the gas flow. Um, the 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 fire button here is a, is a momentary button, so when you take your finger off it, it's not going to fire anymore. Um, it's all positive. Obviously, there's vapor pressure of propane is, is about 100 PSI, maybe a little less at this temperature. Uh, so you don't have any mixing with oxygen or no possibility of combustion until it comes out of the end of the pipe. Uh, so very simple device. The, the, the next one that's planned will be more grandiose and have <laughs> The next uh, one? Well, of course. Uh-huh. <laughs> It's not fun until you build another and you have to build another one. <laughs>